Today I'm taking behind the scenes on how we shot this Valentine's charcuterie board video on an iPhone. Download our app LifeLapse available on iOS and Android devices. Set your phone's auto lock to never so it doesn't switch off while you're capturing your photos. To get started, press the big blue plus sign at the bottom of the screen. For this stop motion, I applied an Instagram overlay so I could see exactly what was going to be captured in my final video. Once your scene is set up, be sure to lock your exposure, white balance and focus so that all the photos stay consistent with each shot. You can see the setup. There wasn't an overhead tripod used. I used a book um, that I had on top of a coffee table as a flat lay option. You can see the phone pointing down on the charcuterie board that's already set up and the light is just out of scene. Each photo was captured using a Bluetooth remote. This video was shot in reverse, so the Valentine's charcuterie board was already set up and the sweets were removed one type at a time using different kinds of animation each time. You could use different kinds of animations just to give complexity to your stop motion video or use the same ones to remove the sweets. And this is what it looked like capturing the photos through the iPhone. Some of the items were a little bit messier, so definitely keep an eye out for any crumbs that might appear to make sure that you clean them away, especially if you're shooting this in reverse. So with each item, it's just a matter of either taking away or making a movement and capturing a photo between each movement or removing of object. You can also use this for any kind of charcuterie board. It doesn't have to be Valentine's themed or sweets themed. You could do it for savory. You could do it for any other kind of party themes, Super Bowl, uh, birthdays, celebrations, anything you can think of. Because this is being shot in reverse with the last two candy items, the bowls were rotated anti-clockwise, bit by bit with a few pieces of candy being removed each time. Again, because this was shot in reverse, it had to be anti-clockwise because when you hit reverse and flip it, you want bowls and candy appearing clockwise. The last candy type did have a sugar coating on it so I did have to kind of clean up some of that sugar in between each of the shots when it got to not being a lot of candy left because 
shooting in reverse means that it was going to appear versus disappear I didn't already want a sugar trail there because that wouldn't have made sense once you've captured all of your photos you can open up the in-app editor and do any editing that you need for this one I resized the video changing the crop so that it was five by four I rotated my video because I liked the side view of it better and increased the speed After this I hit the reverse button because I wanted it to all be appearing as opposed to disappearing. I added a freeze effect to the last frame which you can do for one, two or three seconds to any frames that you want. I then increased my brightness, saturation and warmth. Because I'd captured an extra photo during recording, I did need to delete that. So I can either do that via the timeline or by clicking the grid icon in the top right hand corner and finding the photo and deleting it. Lastly, I went into the music options, which is part of the pro feature and selected a royalty free music that I liked. Once it's all ready, you can save your video. And here's a reminder of the final result. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this free tutorial and you want a chance to win $100 to Amazon, which is by the way, where we buy most of our stop motion gear, please leave us a review in the Apple App Store sharing what you love most about Life Flaps. These reviews help us out a lot and we select a winner each month to get $100 USD to Amazon. All you have to do is go to the Apple App Store, search Life Flaps, scroll down and then click write a review. Share what you love most about Life Flaps, screenshot it, and then DM it to us on Instagram. This will take you no longer than a minute. You'll be helping us out a ton and you'll have a chance to win a hundred bucks. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel so you can be the first to know when we release new stop motion tutorials.